That's Frederick Douglass. All right, that's Frederick Douglass. All right, we're talking about slavery in the 21st century. All right, freedom. If there's no struggle, there's no progress. All right, I got that in 2011 for my birthday. I was kidnapped in 2007 from my family. I was kidnapped December the 24th, 2007, just like the Jesse Smollett story. That's a jailhouse diary from 2007, all right? Buddy Carpenter, Angie Wilson, Denise Sawyer, Dennis Sawyer, my nephew Clay Price, Sharif Dar, FBI 201 West Roosevelt Road. I was kidnapped. That's Jake Davis, all right, on Renwood. And that's April, all right? And that's me, P.O. Box 38, Waukegan, Illinois. My son stole my business from me, and my son thought it was funny that I was locked up. Oh, by the way, Gerald said, could you pick up some toilet paper while you out? He's running a little low. Now, this is while I was in jail. Instead of Jake Davis fighting for my freedom, Jake Davis stole $260,000 from me. That's the IRS. That's the 2008. All right, that's my number, 2008. And that's Paul Weinblatt. Paul Weinblatt, Jake Davis. Paul Weinblatt, Jake Davis, and James Hammond defrauded the government. They defrauded the government. You see that? That's the 2008. That's 2007. That's my number. And that's the numbers we should have been putting up. You feel me? These are the numbers we should have been putting up. These are the numbers. That's Paul Weinblatt. That's Paul Weinblatt. And that's Jake Davis. And that's me in Illinois. That's me in Illinois. Department of Justice, Patrick Fitzgerald. Tampering with legal mail is a federal offense. All right? Sent from a correctional, correctional facilities. Care of. Wayne Kim, U.S. Department of Justice in Washington, D.C. Senator John Conyers, House Judiciary Committee. Ben Cardins, Maryland. Barack Obama, Illinois. That's Barack Obama. And he asked for an investigation. See that? P.O. Box. He asked for an investigation. President Obama asked for an investigation. That's President Biden. That's President Biden in the Department of Justice. That's President Obama. So President Biden, you got to do what you got to do. Because I was making a movie about the prison industry called Letters Design. I was making a movie about black leadership in Baltimore. That's Jack Young, and that's Mayor Brandon Scott. And that's Mayor Brandon Scott. Y'all need to produce that mail. That's Mike Tyson and my grandmother. And that's Delegate Sheila Roof. This is me from the 80s. Like I said, I used to be a drug dealer. I used to be a pimp. I used to do a lot of, a lot of things. But I changed my life when I came to Baltimore in 1991. This is my family. I was kidnapped from my family on February the 7th, 2011. My mother died February the 2nd, 2011. And Jay Davis didn't do nothing. My grandmother died February the 2nd, 2011, and Jake Davis didn't even send her roses, didn't send her flowers. Jake Davis stole from my grand from his grandmother. He stole from my family. Jake Davis, all right? That's Shorty's Bootleg Barbecue, Runners for Justice, Art and Activism, because I was making a movie about your prison industry. That's me, 2007. I was kidnapped by the state, all right? I got everything I need in writing. That's Governor Hogan. That's Governor Hogan. That's Brian Frosch. And that's Mayor Brandon Scott. That's Mayor Brandon Scott. That's State's Attorney's Office. And that's Marilyn Mosby. She got this. June of 2021. I won the Weaver Award. I went from Waukegan's worst to Baltimore's best. And to be the best, you got to beat the best. And you ain't beat me yet. That's City Paper. That's a Heroes Edition. All right? That's the Heroes Edition. And then City Paper, they see it right here. Shorty. Dwayne Shorty Davis. Yeah, read it. Frederick Douglass, Dwayne Davis. We fighting for freedom in 2021, 2022. Governor Hogan got this. 
And that's my lawyer, John Bailey, Karen Levy, Dwayne Davis. And that's the case, 0749490. All right? We talking about racism in the courts. That's President Obama. That's some internal affairs. That's Councilman Branch. And these are emails. Emails gonna send a lot of y'all to jail. Dear Mr. President. Yeah, Brandon Scott and Jack Young got this. Like I said, I'm making a movie. Y'all signed for this. That's Congressman Cummings' office. Congressman Cummings know all about this. You feel me? That's Congressman Cummings' office. Whistleblowers. I'm a whistleblower in the courts and the criminality in the courts behind the war on drugs, N62528. You can go to Jack Young, you can go to Sharon Middleton, you go to the Baltimore City Council, the Baltimore County Council, you go to Michael Fields, you go to Brian Frosch, you go to the State Prosecutor's Office. In 2022, GOP Carter, the Maryland Black Caucus, Stephanie Smith, I was making a movie called Letters Design, Art and Activism. Ain't no law against making a movie. It is a law against kidnapping. If you deny you know me on earth, or you deny you know me in heaven, that's 98 Rock and Shorty. That's P.O. Box 38. That's Patrick Fitzgerald, the Department of Justice. I'm a whistleblower. We are requesting a grand jury, all right, to be convened for these inmates. And that's Attorney Marilyn Mosby, all right? And that's Chuck Grassley, the House Judiciary Committee. That's Chuck Grassley. And this is Shorty's Catering. That's Shorty's, the best of Baltimore, 1999. You see that? The best of Baltimore. And that's Shorty. That's Shorty's. And that's Shorty's Grill. And these other supporters of Shorty's. All right? These people support Shorty's. And we need a federal and state audit, a IRS audit. I'm the best of Baltimore, the best that Baltimore got. Carl Snowden, ACLU, Civil Rights Division. You see that? This is Mr. Fields. In 2-2-22-2012, see the dates? 2-2, all right? Significant number, double deuces. Dear Mr. Fields, this is written. This letter is written to you. It's a legal notice of my intent to sue. You got FCC violations. All right, WJZ, WBAL, ABC2. You feel me? It's all about Governor O'Malley, Congressman Cummings, Cardins, Mikulski, Richard McFeely, the FBI, Judge Bell, Judge Pearson, Judge Turnbull, Judge Boris, Judge Governor Quinn. Eric called the Department of Justice. Yeah, these is my witnesses. All right, these are my witnesses. Shorty, champion for justice. And that's Ray Lewis. So in 2022, we want the grand jury. Marcella Holloman versus Marilyn Mosby. Senate Bill 374, access in the grand jury. You can contact me. I ain't hard to find. Ray Lewis is on the field. I'm in the streets. All night long. Job Opportunity Task Force. We talking about Roland Martin, TV One, Radio One. We talking about Kathleen Hughes. All right. I work for 85% of the richest people in this state. I was making a movie about our government and our, go our government and the war on drugs. This is the case right here. Do blacks have rights in which white America respects? The new face of old Jim Crow? Shorty, pull your mask up. I'm getting ready on Mass Baltimore. That's Governor Hogan. We will confront racism to create a more inclusive and just world. We will not be, we will stand in solidarity with our black partners, customers, and communities. We will not be bystanders. Governor Hogan got a crime bill. And all Governor Hogan want to do in 2022 is lock black people up. 
I'm a black Republican. I'm a black radical Republican. All right? And that's Johnny Oleski. And that's Chuck D from Public Enemy. And that's Ozzie Newsom. That's Ed Molotello. Like I said, I'm making a movie. House of Cards. I'm making a movie all about your prison industry. Maryland's prison industry. O'Malley Brown Money Machine. Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. Shorty underscore nine. That's my phone number. And President Trump got it. Ehrlich got it. Eugene Johnson from Larry Young Show got it. Larry Young got it. Roland Martin got it. Our black leadership got this, but they don't want to talk about ending the war on drugs because they make a lot of money to keep this going. That's Mary Wells from the Supremes. Candidate for filing for 2020 gubernatorial elections. Yeah, I applied for governor. Thanks for what you do, Shorty. Congratulations, Shorty. Like I said, to be the best, you got to beat the best, and I'm still standing. I'm Baltimore's best. The 2021 Weaver Award winner. I'm citywide. Forum panel cites multiple factors for influence kids to join gangs. Dog, I gave you a solution to the problem. I gave you the fall fest. So contact Ray Lewis. Get my shorty program. I ain't hard to find. We're going to end this where we started this at. In a court of law. Runners for Justice, Ravens, and Kathleen Hughes, TV One, Radio One. We're going to talk about being black in America, the new faces of old Jim Crow.